Greetings, fellow classic TV fans. One of my favorite Star Trek episodes was during its first season, entitled The Enemy Within, which also included a few firsts for the popular series. For example, the Leonard Nimoy invented Vulcan nerve pinch, Dr. McCoy's first use of the catchphrase, He's dead, Jim and the physical replication of Captain Kirk, which happened again in two later episodes. Drawing inspiration from the story of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, the episode was written by the legendary Richard Matheson. He was a member of the Southern California Sorcerers, which included other prestigious writers such as Charles Beaumont and Ray Bradbury. Matheson's vast array of novels, screenplays, and short stories in the fantasy, science fiction, and horror genres have influenced many storytellers, including Stephen King and Anne Rice. Directors George Romero, Roger Corman, and Steven Spielberg all regarded him as an influence. Just some of his notable films included The Omega Man, The Incredible Shrinking Man, The Trilogy of Terror, The Pit and the Pendulum, Somewhere in Time, and one of my favorites, the Legend of Hell House. Classic TV movies like Spielberg's 1971 directorial debut, Duel, and 1972's The Night Stalker also came from the mind of Matheson. Of his 16 total classic Twilight Zone scripts, two popular ones come to mind here, specifically Nick of Time and Nightmare at 20,000 Feet, both starring William Shatner. With prestigious awards ranging from his induction into the Science Fiction Hall of Fame to the Bram Stoker and World Fantasy Lifetime Achievement Awards, it's safe to say that Richard Matheson's legacy had indeed boldly gone where no writer had gone before. <laughs>